the buyer's criteria is really, really tough. <laughs> it's getting uh -huh. tougher. They're, um, and then locking things up. I don't understand the a lot of these wholesalers in the Akron area. They're locking them up at retail, and like you can't do that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. It's it, it, it definitely it does not work. I mean, you know, it's it's like a seller's market right now. Yeah. Uh, but you just you know you you can't lock it up at retail and expect it to sell quick to an investor. Right. Um, what was the company you're calling from? Eco Realty Investments. We're, we're based in uh, North Hill. Okay. So, yeah, and then what, what about you? Where, um, where are you guys based? Uh, we're in Hartville, Ohio. So. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was born cool. born and raised in the Akron area down by Summit Lake, so. Um, oh, okay. Yeah. Did you grow up with uh, with LeBron? Nah, like five streets over or something like that, or a couple blocks blocks over from me. Yeah. Oh, cool. Um, he's a little young, real cool. he, he's a little younger than me though. <laughs> um. Oh, cool. Are are you looking? Uh, are you looking to sell properties? Is it, um, or are you looking to buy properties? Well, I or both. So yeah, a little bit, really a little bit of both. I mean, we're we're definitely looking to acquire yeah. uh, properties. We don't have anything for sale ourselves right now. Uh, you know, we're definitely in a buying kind of mode right now. Uh, but I'm always I'm always looking for properties that we can wholesale, mm -hmm. and I'm always looking for properties that we can acquire ourselves. So I, I mean, just we're always buying. We're always in a buying mode. Okay. So if I have something, um, if I have something under contract, you are you looking to JV the deal, or are you looking to take it and add to it, or either or? Uh, well, uh, actually, let me back that up. So um, yeah, if if you have something under contract, yeah. Like, say you've got 10 units, mm -hmm. you know, 10, 10 single-family houses, whatever the case may be. Um, you've got it under contract. It's a good price. You, you know, it seems like you definitely know what you're doing, um, so you would price them accordingly. Mm -hmm. um, I'm not going to take that and, you know, add a couple of grand on top or anything like that um, because that's, that's going to send, you know, conflicting marketing. Yeah. You, you know, yeah. if somebody sees it, marketed by you at one price and then by me at another price. It just doesn't, it muddies the waters. It's what all those, um, you know, kind of amateur wholesalers who daisy chain everything do. Uh, we that. don't, we don't do that. Yeah. I just, I just yeah. went through that one guy offered me 20,000 and then his partner offered me 17,000 on the same property. And then mm -hmm. now it's down to eleven thousand. I'm like, how did you take a twenty thousand dollar property and now you're down to eleven thousand? Mm -hmm. You know, so I'm I'm getting ready to. We do a lot of marketing and networking. Uh, my marketing director mm -hmm. uh, for the company Divine Management. We're on Facebook. Uh, we have a website. I don't post my properties on the website. Um, mm -hmm. It's just if you're looking for something. Um, I have, I have the skill set to, to find it at a discount. I mean, we were just, right. we, my partner and I were just out door to door. So walking door to door, knocking on doors, like, uh, we hit it from the oh, ground wow. running and I've been doing this for over, okay. over two years. So, um, like, and I still go door to door to me, that's the best way to do it. Plus it's kind of like free advertisement. Yeah, absolutely. Um, well, that's cool. You're having success with that. Yeah, yeah. Um, so I, I, I'll tell you what. I'll give you my email address. Absolutely. It's uh, Roger 